The most powerful local football confederation will have a presidency change in the next 10 days as Wayne Shaw, president of the Kingston and St. Andrew Football Association, has signaled his intention to resign from the post. Jerome Foster reports. Weeks before Ambassador Stuart Stevenson challenged Michael Ricketts for the presidency of the Jamaica Football Federation in 2017, it created a vacancy at Kasafa. Up stepped Wayne Shaw, who was ushered into the position after years of being the general secretary of the largest football confederation locally. Having completed the mandate of Ambassador Stevenson, Shaw has now pulled the plug on his own tenure. Eight months shy of its completion, he advised his executive of the decision on Tuesday evening. There were rumors recently that Shaw was feeling the pressure from clubs who wanted to participate in the Tier 2 competition as well as the financial struggles of the body. Shaw says his time has come after personal introspection. Well, yes, there's one third president of Kasafa, you will always be present. And every past president can attest to that. It's not an easy job, not an easy job. I mean, I mean to keep all the affiliates happy, then it's you and the JFF, you know. So it's not an easy job. As I said earlier, sponsorship is an issue. Um, I guess come next year, things like the country has opened up, so things might get a little but It has been difficult to re-sponsorship. The final whistle might have been blown for sure, but he backs the Federation to find a suitable replacement even as they come to terms with the previous departure of General Secretary Dwayne Dillon. I think there are a lot of people out there who can do a, um, a good job and even a, bit, a better job than me. Um, we have people from other clubs. Um, we have people like Andrew Price, Andrew Versio, people like those I think would be... Good people, Mark Bennett, who is the second vice president, um, and Cabell. But so we still have good people there in the association who can replace him. While he was running with the battles of Kasafa, Shaw says there were severe difficulties elsewhere. The most challenging part of it? <laughs> Dealing with the JFF. That is one of the most challenging. Well, that, that comes from some of the policies and the things that um, the JFF are implementing and Kasafa are not as agreeing with it. So we'll always be having that to and from, to and from. The experienced administrator says one of his major accomplishments was seeing the operation of an under-10 league on the back of the COVID-19 pandemic. While there are impending questions for the state of the parish confederation, restoring their image is also at the forefront. Jerome Foster, TVJ Sports.